So today is Valentine's Day, so happy Valentine's Day to all of you out there who celebrate it, to those of you who don't, happy anti-Valentine's Day. Um, I'm sure that everyone's doing something fun and exciting, um, unless they are going to be sat watching Twilight hating their lives like I am tonight. Sad times. <laughs> no, me and my sister, we were like, right, we don't have boyfriends, so all we need is each other, we're going to sit, we're going to watch Twilight, we're going to eat our weight in popcorn. Um, and just basically make ourselves even less appealing to the opposite sex. <laughs> nice. Um, but anyway, so the best thing about this Valentine's Day for me is that, oh, by the way, I have false lashes on right now, you can tell. Um, it's just because I've been practicing with them because I'm so terrible at putting on false lashes and, like, this is the best I could do. So when I say I'm terrible, you know I'm not lying. Um, and... So yeah, I was practicing this morning, I was kind of bored, and I thought, oh, I'll practice putting on some false lashes, why the devil not? Um, one thing led to another, and before I knew it, there's these hairy things all over my face. Um, and that's what they look like. I don't even know which brand these are, because I just literally found, like, two random false lashes, like, in my makeup box, and I was just like, okay, stick them on, see what it looks like, and, um, yeah, so this is the full effect. Back to why this Valentine's Day is good for me. Um, this Valentine's Day is good for me because I am announcing my giveaway winner. So, um, just over a month ago, I started a giveaway over on my blog, um, which you can find the link for in the description box below. Um, I started to run this giveaway because I reached um, 150 followers on my blog and I was really happy with it. Um, so, I decided that I'd like to give a little something back. And I also figured I'll announce it on Valentine's Day because, you know, not everybody has a fantastic, like, perfect boyfriend and a perfect Valentine's Day, so I thought it would lift some spirits out there. Um, so since then, I've actually built my followers even more, and I'm now on 256, which means so much to me. I mean, I'm not one of those bloggers who's like, oh, if you don't have followers, then it doesn't count or whatever, because, you know, followers in no way... Um, translate to blog traffic at all like it it's just doesn't happen basically because well, I'm not going to go into it but like with Google Friend Connect being cancelled on non-blogger sites um, and just the fact in general that so many people may read your blog but don't have a Google account and can't sign up and stuff like that um, means that it really doesn't matter so if you don't have a lot of followers out there then like don't feel discouraged and don't feel like I'm telling you that you're not good because you don't have any followers um, because you definitely are. I mean, I actually run a blog for my parents, um, and the traffic to that site is huge, but there is two followers, and I'm one of them. <laughs> and me on my other blog, I'm one of the followers. Um, so, you know, it really doesn't count that much, but it is fantastic to know that there are followers that click follow and they return, you know, they come back um, to my page whenever I post something new, um, and it's that kind of follower loyalty that I really wanted to kind of honour with this um, giveaway. So I'm sure you saw my giveaway video in the past but again this is what the prize is. It's a model's own bag of goodies um, and I'll just show you some of the things. It has a Juicy Couture body lotion, um, Barry M lip gloss, the model's own lip gloss which is so nice I have one myself. Um, I actually put a splodge of mine on today on top of the lipstick that I have on now but you can't really tell so much because it's so pigmented um, when you put like enough of it on. Um, just some ultimate wrinkle correction cream which I figured would be a cute a cute little thing because I know that a lot of um, my readers aren't wrinkled um, but I figured you know they could give it to their mums or they could do something sweet like that or you know I actually use that stuff as prevention like around my lips and around my eyes anyway because I have some I use it here like around where I get frown lines and around my eyes and like around my mouth so you know it's all good um then there was some mini 17 lip glosses which were in these shades which I'll show you now those shades there was also um a clear one at the time when I announced this giveaway um However, <laughs> um, it would seem that it's vanished. And I have no idea where it could have gone because I haven't opened the bag since um, since I announced the giveaway. I'm thinking perhaps my sister may have robbed it, like 
sounds like something she would do although she doesn't really use lip gloss so I don't even know how it would have happened unless it fell out of the bag somewhere um so it when you receive the winner receives um the bag it it will be missing one of these the one in the clear color um and I do apologize but I have thrown in um a couple of extra things which I'm sure are random but um kind of beneficial I, I they're surprises so I'm not going to tell you much more about it but anyway, um, also in the bag is another Barry M lip gloss in this coral colour, the Glossy Tubes. Um, a NARS foundation sample, which is in um, a particular colour, I think it's in the Deauville colour. However, I've used it on my sister, myself, and on my friend, and it this is one of them colours that I'm not sure whether it's supposed to, but it kind of develops to your skin tone. Um, well, that's the case that we found because my sister's really dark my friend is really pale um, and it suited us also good stuff um, I have Dazzle Dust by Barry M in my favourite shade which I think is 51 I picked this up at the clothes show however the sticker on the bottom I'm not sure if you can tell but that's like wrong the 5 is upside down um, and I don't really know why that is like like I said, I picked it up at the clothes show, and if you don't believe me, <laughs> for whatever reason, then you can head over to my clothes show hall, and I showed it then at the time, and I said, like, I don't really know why the five is upside down, like, because some people may think, oh, it's fake, you know, the five's upside down, um, and I really don't believe it is fake, because I bought it at the clothes show, along with a bunch of other things that I bought, and I don't think that Barry M would have had a fake, um, like, a stall selling fraudulent product. Um, although, in hindsight, perhaps the reason why it's upside down is because maybe at the clothes show they sell, like, faulty products, um, like products that have been printed or packaged wrong, and perhaps that's why this doesn't have the five the right way up. But um, it is, I do have another of these of my own, and I love it. Look at my chipped nail varnish, it looks awful. Actually, you know, it looks like I've done, like, a deliberate French manicure a little bit. Um, but with like a purple lilac shade <laughs> anyway um, so yeah this is one of my favourite colours for creating a smoky eye then I have this which is one of my favourite nails ink colours and it looks kind of black there but it's not it's in the shade Victoria and with one coat this is like a fuchsia colour and with two this is like a purple it's really cool and then finally I have this Barry M nail paint in coral and if you haven't used Barry um, nail paint before I think that they are one of the most fabulous um, quality of nail varnishes that I've ever used to be completely honest I have a big old bunch of them um, so it's all good anyway so what you really want to know and I'll put all them back in the bag oh no where's it gone yeah. um, like there you see is who has won the giveaway so, I know a lot of people tend to use websites like Rafflecopter, no, Rafflecopter, what am I on about? Um, Rafflecopter, or something like that. I don't even know what that website is, so, but basically that's why I didn't use it, because I don't know anything about it. Um, but I have just kind of done it in a very <laughs> traditional way. I basically, um, for every entry that someone put forth I printed off their details um, on like a word document printed it off cut them all out and well there you go <laughs> like um, and I just figured that would just be easier for me like you can tell like some of these it took me ages to do I'm not gonna lie but it was kind of therapeutic I did it before I went to sleep last night all this cutting out and stuff and like scrunching up I like scrunching paper like um, but you can tell like loads that they're all like different sizes like for different entries different sorts of entries um but yeah so i'm basically just going to choose one um from here and that will be my winner and i will um send an email over to the winner as soon as i possibly can um to get their address details and stuff and i will be posting the bag of goodies and a couple more bits, um, the random bits that I was talking about, and hopefully that person will blog about what I've sent them because, um, I said like those are really, some really good beauty products right there. I really think that like this is quite a good giveaway, um, and the things that I'm sending, the surprises are also really quite bloggable in my opinion, um, so 
Yes. Um, oh, I hope this person's not a vegetarian, whoever wins. Because that may make things difficult for me. <laughs> They'll just have to give the thing to someone else. Yeah, I'm sending them meat. I know. What could it be? But anyway. So, let me pick a name from here now. Oh, I don't know which one to choose. I'm so nervous. I wanted to do this last night because I was so excited. I felt like I was saying to him someone on Twitter that felt like the night before Christmas, like where you really want to know who's won. Um, but then I want to pick one and then it'd be and then it'd be someone that I don't know or something like that, but I have to. Don't be silly. Um, and for all the all the people that have entered as well, I have um, gone and checked out your blog if you have a blog of your own and I've followed most of them. I think I've followed all of them to be honest, but there was a couple from last that entered last night and I'm not sure whether I had a chance to follow them yet. But I'm, I will get round to it, I promise. So, let's go with this one. So nervous. <laughs> Who could it be? Who could it be? Okay, so this was a Facebook entry. Mm -hmm. Fun thingy dip. And the winner is Helen Wilkinson. And I think that she, um, I think that she has a blog that's called something like Damsels in Distress or Damsels Under Dress or something like that. It's a really cute blog. Um, and I will link it in the description bar below so you can go and check it out. But uh, so I remember her because I checked out um, her blog and she gave in quite a few entries. Um, so that was really nice of her. So I'm, I'm glad that she won. I think she, she earned this um, prize. So there you go, Helen Wilkinson. I will tweet you. Um, and perhaps you might see this before I even get to tweet you, which would be kind of cool because you wouldn't have known that you were going to win. And I announced it like with all the, you know, bells and whistles with the scrunching up the paper. And I love that sound of paper scrunching up. Dreamer, what are you doing? Look, this is my kitty. She doesn't like being picked up, so I'll pick her up anyway. <laughs> Isn't she cute? Ah. <laughs> it's like, I want to go, let me go. Um, yeah, so Helen, well done, and thank you for being a follower, and thank you for putting through so many entries, um, I really appreciate it, and I can feel the hair on my face, and it's freaking me out. So yeah, happy Valentine's Day guys, I'm sorry to all those of you that didn't win, um, I will run another giveaway soon, I promise, once I've managed to collect up some more goodies to um, give away, perhaps when I get to... Perhaps when I get to 300 followers, or 350 followers, so I'm like 100, and now I'm like 90, 94 away. So um, if you want to be notified to that giveaway, then please go over to my blog, which is linked down there. Um, and also hit subscribe, which is right there. What's this pen? Um, and click on all my links down below so you'll hear about the giveaway when I start to run it. Um, and then you'll have as many entries as you possibly can. So thank you for watching. Happy Valentine's Day. Have a good night, whether you're hating life or um, loving some sexy man or sexy woman, you know, whichever floats your boat, fine by me. Um, and I will speak to you next time. So take care, guys. Bye. Shine, shine, shine on.